What's up, y'all? Fresco VK live here at Stadium Goods, and we're located on 47 Howard Street, Manhattan, Soho area, so please feel free to pull up. I got a special unboxing look for you guys today, once again, as we close out the year with the Yeezy 700 V3 Asle. I know y'all wanna know what that looks like, but we're gonna take a look right here, so say less of all this talking, let's get straight to these shoes. We have the same standard Yeezy box top, and please let me know what you guys think in the comments. I actually think these are I like these. I'm not normally an easy guy, but I think these are really fire. But the Yeezy 700 V3 as well. As you look throughout the entire upper, it is almost, I won't say it's totally different from the, the original 700, but there's definitely some updates. It's a chunkier outsole, midsole, excuse me, you see right there. So it's almost fully sale throughout the entire caging. So you see the RPU caging here, and you definitely see the three stripes hits within the middle there. You'll see the translucent hit on the inner panel there, just above the midsole, and the same reach for the outer panel with the translucent area just above the midsole. There is uh, no pull tab on the tongue, no logo on the tongue, just a straight black tongue, but as you get to the black laces, you'll see that in the lace area, you'll catch your hits of 3M towards the bottom of the lace area. As we get to the back, no back pull tab, but as you can see, the shoe is layered, so we have the overlay here, the underlay with the white, and the under underlay with the black, and of course the Adidas and the Truffle logo right in the back area. As we get to the outsole, you'll see one of the main things about this shoe is that it does not feature the boost that you see in most Yeezy silhouettes. So they've done away with the boost for the Yeezy 700 V3, but it's, uh, it still seems like it's pretty comfortable. I haven't tried it on yet, but it looks pretty comfortable. But And back to the outsole once again with the sail hits throughout, but we have a light blue and then like a royal blue detailing on these inner panels. And I'll give you guys one last look. Please let me know in the comments what you think of the Yeezy 700 V3. Like I mentioned earlier in the video, I actually think these are pretty fire. I don't know if I'd wear them yet, but I think they look aesthetically pretty dope. So let me know what you guys think in the comments and let me know which one of the Yeezy 700s is your favorite. Is it version one, version two, or now even version three? But we have all of them available right here at Stadium Goods and we're located on 47 Howard Street, Manhattan, Soho area. So please feel free to pull up. Thank you guys for liking and sharing all of our videos on Facebook, YouTube, and now of course, Instagram TV. Please make sure you follow at Stadium Goods on all social media platforms and don't forget to check out Stadium Women. Make sure you download the Stadium Goods app. It's available on iOS and on Android. And if you have any questions or inquiries regarding anything Stadium Goods, please visit stadiumgoods.com. I am Fresco VK and salute.